Hello Aries, welcome to your horoscope for May 2023. This month we do also have another lunar eclipse that is happening on the 6th of May in your 8th house, that's the house of money. And remembering that uh, with eclipses it can take up to 6 months to take effect. So this will be looking at uh, money situations here, financial um, with other people, could be looking um, to do with like business or partnerships, or also looking at loans and investments as well. On the 8th of May, Venus will go into your 4th house, the house of family. So in this um, part, you'll probably be looking at making your house nice. Could be um, doing some spring cleaning. You'll also be looking, this also could be a, a form of selling your house too, because with Venus, it's not only love, it's also money. Um, it can also be um, quite improvements and positive, um, positive aspects of the family and the home. On the 15th of May, you've got Mercury going direct in your second house. This is going to be house of earnings. So this can be looking at when it's safe to sign contracts, starting new shifts, um, we're communicating or thinking about next move in terms of your work. On the 17th, you've got Jupiter, which goes into your second house. This will be for a year. So this will be luck with earnings. So this is a good time to earn more money. Um, also self-worth. Um, feeling better about yourself too and then on the uh, 21st we've got Mars is going into your fifth house this can be relations, relationships and children on the negative side of Mars I say it's, it's anger and frustration so you might find there is a bit of frustration and anger in relationships in general but also like ones that you're very close to and also with your children for those who have children um, it can also be a strength as well so it can be either way I would say Mars is a double-edged sword when we look at the cards here, Aries, it's like you're very independent. You're in a playful mood this month as well. You are looking at being honoured or being um, job well done. This is like gratitude that's coming to you for you, like for you this month. It's like you're being blessed almost. But there is an aspect of I feel like love, playfulness vibe here. Um, and it's like we're looking after children, looking after someone else's best intentions here that I feel. The emotions, it's like sometimes during this month, I feel like especially in the middle of the month, it is going to be feeling like an uphill battle. But there's also, it's like you're having to look after someone or you're having to take responsibility for someone too. And, and that, this could be to do with even like a health aspect that could be coming up here too. I feel like there's people complaining around you. Where you're having to also maybe make peacemaker too, but people are whinging or complaining around you. But then there's also this Eureka moment too, where you feel like there's, um, and again, this is to do with like health, where there's like storm, like so things maybe might be feeling like there's things that could be improving with your health or things that feel like um, that you need to be seen to, whether it be you or someone else around you, that you need to pay attention. I feel like we've got to pay attention to be overeating this month. There's something about here, like over self-indulgent, overeating, something we've got to pay attention this month for you guys, for Aries, um, um, with, in terms of your health. When we look at your work here, it's like with your work here, um, it might feel like it's a bit of a slow, like a, a slow pace. You're moving at a slow pace this, at this point, especially coming in the beginning of the month. It even could be like poor me, sort of um, victim mode, because you do have Jupiter going into this area, not until the 17th, so towards the middle, towards the end. Um, but there is this card here, which I always feel like it's like, um, I just think like poor me, so like victim mentality of things not going well, but the snail pace, you, there is some positive here. And you do, uh, you might be having to be in control or, or look at where you are in your work but there is also a thing of being a, slow, being a bit slower than you want it to be. I feel like the energy around you, it's like it's up to you to make a difference here. I, everyone's looking or perhaps this could even be someone else around you, not even you, but this person needs to look on the bright side, be thankful for what they have and it could be time for them to even maybe move on. When we look at family, I've got some really good things here, family. I feel like it's about reconnecting, coming together. It's about building, um, building positive vibes and building on what you already know that you have here with family. It's sort of togetherness. It's like, but it's hard work. It's like you can get together, but it's a little bit hard work here. Um, 
it could be like a rocky relationship here with siblings uh, so see where it gets hard work but it's like i feel like the same time with family here it's a very positive aspect i feel like for those who are looking to sell it might not be a good time to sell or looking at perhaps you're looking at completing a sale of a house and you're looking at signing but it's like there's there are some warnings you just be aware that everything is lining up to where you want it to go when we look here at um relationship oh i've got your money as well here i feel like with money here we're having to negotiate budgets negotiate where we are and um, we're not quite there we want to be but we really do negotiate but at the same time we're feeling a bit lazy we're slacking off we're not getting up to doing what we need to do and get things done you really need to be start being prepared and being more like active in this area and to really push yourself but like you're negotiating budgets here can we look at relationships for you okay like you're very confident in yourself this month here with relationships you are wanting new relationships to blossom around you and old ones to stay loyal to stay keep faith in here but you're also as an aspect of here of also fighting or fighting off people that you don't want around you it's like a tug of war here that i am feeling of like funning it's like a bit of like fun and games that's coming on you are going to get received a message if like someone you haven't heard from in a while or a long time is going to con contact you and this contact is going to be i feel like very positive contact that's coming in here i feel like there is going to be feeling a bit disappointed like you're going out somewhere to meet someone but it's an aspect of being disappointed i feel also it's coming up this month for you here aries and I just feel like there's a longing here of wanting to get away, of holidaying. There is a, a longing to do that. With some of the health stuff that I was picking up before, it could even be to do with a friend. I feel like there's some, some health things to do, issues with around a friend here, where you might even need to be their support. That could be there to do with uh, a friendship that's coming up here to you, Aries. I will get, um, see what else I can get for you. Okay. Aries. This is a month where you're going to need your patience. Do not blow your top, do not go over angry, and do not be over ambitious. For the ambitious will come next month when everything will seem to flow more smoothly for you. This month you're trying to negotiate plans and to activate ones that you've been wanting to do for a long time. Finally, things are coming in the right area of, of your life for your finances to start to improve, but not without you doing the hard work. For those who sit back and be lazy will get nowhere. For those who are prepared to put the work in and be more prepared and be proactive, We'll definitely get a head start and we'll also be able to achieve what the results they are dreamed by for next year okay thank you for your likes shares and your comments and i will see you for my next video um, or my next horoscope so bye for now